In today's video, I'm gonna talk about 13 different AI courses or certifications that can help you land an AI-related remote job. Now, some of these courses are going to be to actually help you create AI, so sort of the math and the science behind how AI works so that you can understand it on a deeper level. And then some of them are going to be to help you use AI in order to help businesses and make things more efficient and streamlined. So if you appreciate me doing these types of videos, let me know by gently tapping that like button. And let's jump into it with number one on the list, which is going to be prompt engineering for chat GPT which is a course that is hosted on Coursera. Now this one was actually created by Vanderbilt University and over 200,000 people have already taken the course. And at the end of taking the course, you get a shareable certificate that you can put on your resume or in your portfolio. Now the course takes approximately 18 hours to finish and you can learn at your own pace. It has a flexible schedule. And this is basically going to teach you advanced concepts when it comes to prompt engineering with ChatGPT. And prompt engineering is incredibly important because of a concept called GIGO. And GIGO stands for garbage in, garbage out. And if you put a garbage prompt into an AI, unfortunately, it's going to give you a garbage output. However, if you put a good prompt into AI, it's going to give you a really good output. And so prompt engineering is incredibly important if you want to properly use AI. Now, there are a bunch of different types of jobs that you could get into. Some of them are going to be AI engineers that make about $125,000 to $193,000 a year, AI product managers that make about $155,000 to $241,000 a year and AI prompt managers that make a ton of money too. Now this course has a ton of positive reviews online, including in places like Reddit. And yeah, this would be a great place to learn how to properly prompt. Hey guys, in the editing process right now, but quick pause to give you a special deal from Coursera. Coursera is currently offering the Coursera Plus monthly promo. This is where learners will get access to over 7,000 courses. All of this for 50% off the monthly subscription. Now, remember last year they did a promo similar to this. I mentioned it in one of my videos. A bunch of people got into it and they were super happy with it, but a bunch of people missed out on it. And this is going to be for a limited time. So if you're on the fence about it, this is the absolute best time to jump into Coursera Plus. Don't want you to miss out on it. So it's gonna be down in the description as well as the pinned comment below. But anyways, back to the video now. The next one is going to be Introduction to Generative AI. And this is going to be a Google cloud skill boost course. Now this sounds very complicated, but it's actually a beginner's course that will take you anywhere from hours to days in order to complete. And it's basically going to help you have a deeper understanding of the foundations of generative AI. There are five modules in the course, which I'll have pop up on the screen. And although this one won't get you a job on its own, it will look very good if you put it on your resume or in a portfolio. And also the skills that you learn are going to help you do the job itself. So just as an example, AI research scientists make 109 to 163 thousand dollars a year and i know this one isn't going to get you into a job like that but it will help if you already have some of the other skills that they're looking for this one might also help you to land something like a digital content strategist type job and they pay around 62 to 104 thousand dollars a year and so yeah this is a really good one if you want to have more of an understanding of how ai actually works which will help you even if you're not going to be an ai programmer or something you know really complicated like that next is going to be the chat gpt prompt engineering for developers by by OpenAI and Deep Learning AI. And this is hosted on deeplearning.ai. And this one is really exciting because one of the instructors is actually Andrew Ng. And yes, I know I'm probably saying his name wrong. I apologize. But he is basically a legend in the machine learning slash AI industry. So I have a really good friend who is a machine learning engineer. And this guy basically takes every single course or every single certificate that Andrew Ng puts out. And he absolutely loves it. And this teaches you prompt engineering, but it also comes from a developer's perspective, right? So it's the development of the ability for the AI to understand the prompts. Now this course only takes about one hour to finish. So it is fairly easy. It is fairly baseline. You don't need to be super advanced in order to take this course. And it is actually a certification. So you get a certification after you finish it. And this is basically gonna teach you how to write code much faster using prompt engineering. So one career path you might go into after taking a course like this, where this would look really good on your resume or on your portfolio, Portfolio would be an AI implementation specialist. And they make about 55 to $86,000 a year. By the way, if you're enjoying this and you think of somebody else
else who might also enjoy it, go ahead and share it with them. Maybe a friend, a family member, or someone who just needs to get a job and make some money. Next is going to be the IBM Applied AI Professional Certificate. Now this one is hosted on Coursera and it is a relatively new course. And at the end of it, you get a certificate that again will look very good on a resume or a portfolio. And they say it will take about three months if you're doing it at about 10 hours per week. However, most of the Coursera certificate programs take a lot less than whatever they say on the website. I've noticed this over and over again. So usually if they say it takes six months, it takes anywhere from two weeks to two months at most. So I'm guessing this one says three months. So it's probably going to be one week to a month or so somewhere around there. Now it's a seven course series. It is beginner level and it's rated 4.6 stars out of five, which is great. And basically this is geared towards mastering sort of the practical applications of AI. So using AI in your day to day experience and basically using it for real world scenarios that are outside of, you know, being a data scientist or a software developer. And this might help you to figure out how to utilize AI better in different industries. And one career path you might go down is becoming an AI consultant, and they make about $103,000 to $163,000 a year. So you can see a lot of these AI-related jobs make really, really good money. Next is going to be the AWS Certified Machine Learning Certification. And this is actually offered by AWS or Amazon.com. AWS is a part of Amazon, and it stands for Amazon Web Services. Now, this one is more advanced. This is going to to dive into more complicated machine learning concepts, but it takes about 180 minutes in order to complete the exam. And if you pass the exam, you get this certification. And it basically showcases your ability to design, implement, and deploy machine learning solutions efficiently using AWS services. So AWS is one of the largest sort of cloud platforms out there and anything related to AWS, whether it's you know just being able to do the basic stuff or whether you're doing it for IT or whether you're coding on it is super, super valuable. So this is going to be for the more advanced people out there and specifically people who want to combine machine learning with AWS. So probably not for most people out there. Another one that can be really good, and I've actually covered this one on the channel, is the IBM Data Analyst Certificate. And this one is also hosted on Coursera. So this is going to be more on the data analyst side of things. However, understanding that side of things is going to help tremendously when it comes to understanding AI and how it works. Because at the end of the day, AI basically just takes in a bunch of data and it outputs something that it thinks is going to be valuable to a human being. So understanding the data analysis side of things is very important. Now it says that this one takes about four months with three hours of study per week. Again, Coursera almost always overestimates how long it's going to take. This likely only takes, you know, maybe two weeks to a month. So one career path you might go down if you went in this direction would be a business intelligence assistant. They make about $127,000 to $189,000 a year or a data visualization manager and they make about ninety-three dollars to $141,000 a year. So I'm going to go over several other data related certificates. Some of them are a little easier than others. But the next one is going to be the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate. And I've also covered this one on the channel and it is absolutely phenomenal. This one is also hosted on Coursera and they say it takes about six months at 10 hours per week. In reality, most people report that it takes about one to two months to finish. It has eight modules inside of it that they call courses and it's rated 4.8 stars with over 128,000 ratings. It's also been beginner level and you can even earn degree credit when you take the course. So this one is going to be more of a beginner type thing when it comes to learning about data. Some of the other ones are a little more advanced. Like the next one on the list I'm going to go over is definitely more advanced. But some career paths you might go down are business intelligence analysts. They make about eighty six to one hundred and twenty four thousand dollars a year. An analytics coordinator. They make about sixty one to ninety five thousand dollars a year. Lots and lots of phenomenal ratings online for this one. This is actually probably tied for my favorite Coursera certificate. And that's saying a lot because Coursera has some phenomenal certificates. So yeah, this one is great. Next one on the list is going to be the IBM data science certificate also hosted on Coursera. Now data science is much more complicated than data analytics. So this is not really a beginner certificate. This is for someone who's already kind of gotten through the data analytics side of things. They're probably already working as well. And they want to upskill and get themselves into a higher level position. Now it says that it takes about five months if you're working about four hours a week. Again, you 
usually they're overestimated, but with these higher level ones, it's probably a little more accurate, but realistically, it's probably gonna take around two months. It's rated 4.6 out of five stars, which is great. They say that it's beginner friendly, but realistically, it's not. You would probably wanna have some experience, at least take a bunch of other certifications or certificates before you take this one. And they show that the median US salary for data scientists is about 138,000, which is great. And it has about 10 different modules. So yeah, another really good one, little bit above beginner level in my opinion. However, if you're really smart, maybe you could take it as a beginner. Next is going to be the machine learning specialization. And this one is also hosted on Coursera. Now this one is definitely not for beginners. Machine learning is just like mega brain. It's like big brain stuff. However, this is another course that has Andrew Ng in it. So anything that has Andrew Ng in it is going to be great. And it has a 4.9 star rating with over 5,900 ratings and 99% of people give it a thumbs up. It takes approximately 33 hours to finish the course. And it's actually course number one out of three different machine learning courses. And yeah, I mean, there's tons of super high paying jobs you can get into with this. So machine learning engineers make about 125 to $187,000 a year. Machine learning research assistants make 106 to 150 thousand dollars a year predictive analytics specialists make 96 thousand to 131 thousand dollars a year and like I said there's a lot of reviews of this online this person for instance landed a job three months after taking the certificate and yeah just really really good stuff another one the next one on the list very similar is the deep learning specialization also with Coursera the certificate also has Andrew Ng as a professor and they say it takes approximately five months to complete if you study eight hours per week usually it's much faster I'm guessing this is probably more like you know two months months or so. And this is rated 4.9 stars with 127,000 ratings. So really, really good stuff. And there's actually a review online of someone who's obviously really smart because they're a data scientist already. And they took about two weeks to finish the course. Now, this is probably not going to be for beginners again. However, even as a beginner, you'd probably learn a lot. You just have to do a lot of extra studying because you wouldn't get a lot of the concepts. And there's tons of positive feedback on this one online. And yeah, just a really good one. Next one on the list is going to be generative AI with large language models. This one is also hosted on Coursera. About 166,000 people have already taken it. This one they say takes about approximately 16 hours to finish. And it basically focuses on large language models. And it explores techniques for generating creative and contextually relevant text using advanced language models, providing practical skills in natural language processing and generation. So basically the language generating side of AI. So yeah, another really good one. Um, again, I wouldn't really call this a beginner one. It's pretty complicated stuff, but maybe you could just take that as a challenge if you're a beginner and take it anyways and prove me wrong. Go ahead and subscribe if you're going to prove me wrong and let me know how it went in the future. Next is going to be natural language processing with deep learning. And this one is actually offered by stanford.edu. So it's offered by basically an Ivy League university. And the course number for this one is CS224N and it's offered for free online. So this focuses on NLP or natural language processing, and it uses deep learning strategies and techniques. And basically, Basically, it focuses on applying neural networks to various NLP related tasks and helps you to gain insights into cutting edge developments in language understanding and generation. So again, this one is very important to understand like how AI works. And at the same time, if you're somebody who's actually like working on AI, this is going to help you as well. For instance, conversational AI architects make about 105 to $169,000 a year. NLP research scientists make about 144 to $203,000 a year. And there are lots of positive reviews online for this one. So yeah, another really good one. Next one on the list is going to be project management for conversational AI. And this is offered by the Cognigy Academy. And I'm probably saying that wrong as well. I'm sure I'm going to get some comments down in the comment section telling me. And this basically focuses on project management and conversational AI. So participants are going to learn the intricacies of planning, executing and overseeing projects related to chatbots, voice assistants and conversational interfaces, gaining expertise in efficiently managing conversational AI initiatives. Now, now, this course takes about 90 minutes to finish. And this course is for project managers, product owners, and conversational AI professionals with prior experience on bot projects. And they say this course is perfect for people who are challenged with building advanced bots at scale. So yeah, this one, uh, there's a lot of different jobs this could help with. One of them would be a solution delivery manager. They make about 126 to 187 thousand dollars a year. And guys, like you can see, just anything AI related is just making crazy good money. Whether you get into a job or you do it as a freelancer or you start a business with it. I mean, anything AI related 
is just crushing it. And this is another one where I found a lot of good reviews online. So Cognigy.ai um, has like a 4.8 star rating, which is great. And yeah, just had a lot of good ratings online. A lot of people seem to like it. And by the way, if you liked a lot of these certificates and you want to see some other certificates that are super high paying, I did make a video called the Google Certificate Tier List. And you can check that out by clicking right here.